We're going to look at ball skill sessions now. So these are really specific areas in the court that you're practicing skills and how, how quick you can do them. This can be a standalone session, but you can also mix and match this with your own uh, standard shot solo practice, but also within routines just before you're playing a match. It, it, they're very, very, uh, there's a lot of variability in these, which is great and very varied. So we'll have a look and show you some of the exercises uh, that we can do. Peter's pretty up for this, so it's gonna be exciting. All right, so we're gonna start with the, the, the figure of eights, but to start with off, off the floor, off the ground. It's quite a nice way to kind of gradually get warmed up. Body position on the tee. He's primarily hitting the ball underneath the cut line. That's nice. And now we're gonna go from this one into the actual figure of eight volleys. So the figure of eight volleys. Again, the better you get at this, the quicker you do it, the faster it happens. So the, me the way you measure these is purely by how fast you're able to do this. and a great way of getting the ball really, really warm. That's great, okay. So the ball's mega, mega warm now. So I reckon from there, we're gonna look at the uh, side to side volleys. Okay, here we go. Doing this with a mega warm ball is very, very difficult. And I'm quite surprised how well he's doing this. This is a very hard practice. <laughs> there is one variation from this for the more advanced, if they want to challenge. Peter will actually have his, his back to the cameras for this one, but it's actually uh, to the wall, front wall, side wall, front wall, side wall. Peter's just going to demonstrate that. <laughs> that is mega advanced. Uh, there's a few players that I know can do this, but Peter's not one of them. Um, so if we go on to, if we go from the volleys and we go into the service box area, let's have a look at that one. So this is a wonderful one. It looks very basic, but I can assure you that he's looking to hit it underneath the short line. This is brilliant for racket head speed off the ground. Good body position, strength of base, keeping the ball nice and tight. You have to really get your preparation up. With this one, you can even vary it by going closer to the front wall. So hitting it hard, low to the front wall. Again, this works on racket head speed. This is quite an advanced practice, but something to work towards. Okay, Peter, that's great. Thank you. So he would replicate that on the backhand side. He would do that on the backhand side. And now we're gonna go back to some volleys. I'd like you to do the, the, the corner to corner volleys now. Very, very good for racket head speed and racket preparation going from forehand to backhand with the swing. His racket's up all the time. So it builds a huge amount of strength. Also with solo practice, it builds so much strength in your forearm and your arms. Honestly, this is, you'll feel, Peter will feel that his, um, his heavily tattooed forearm is actually filling up with a lot of blood. Have you got the nice pump on there? Yeah, you can see that, he's got great forearms. Okay, he would also do that on the backhand side as well. And then we've got the, uh, I would say, the, the kind of just the side to side volley as well on the front wall. So would you, Peter's starting a bit closer. He can move back to the tee a little bit on this one. This tests the angle that you're hitting on the front wall. So this, you have to get the angle really nicely right, which is a skill in its own right. Superb. And then I would say the last one we would do would be the, uh, the volley very, very close up, but moving backwards all the way to probably behind the service box, okay, the straight volley. So he'd start off, so the basic amateurs would start off here. This is really nice. Again, you can see he's grooving his swing. This is fine. You can practice it. As you get more confident, start to move backwards, getting further and further back. 
So eventually, Peter will be looking to be around about service box area, just behind the service box. And then he can also tweak it by moving back forward again through the shot. There we go, he's moving back. Brilliant, thank you very much, that was awesome. Really, really good, really good.